I thought what a great opportunity. We have uh, all these uh, uh, students in our audience tonight. Yeah. I thought it'd be great to maybe take some questions oh, from them. Great. I'd like that. Is that okay? Yes, of course. Uh, where, Brianna from NYU. Uh, where is uh, Brianna? <laughs> hey, how? Uh, go ahead, Brianna. Hi, Senator. So, as a first generation college student that comes from a lower socioeconomic background, student loans were kind of inevitable for me. Sure. And with graduation right around the corner for me, I want to know what you would do for students like me who are going to graduate with massive amounts of student debt. Yeah, that's right. It's one of the biggest issues facing our students. Here's my plan one, we need to have debt free college, we need to have free community college, and I'm also um, prepared to make sure that we provide interest free loans. Because nobody should be profiting. Brianna, nobody should be profiting off of your desire to get an education. Right? So, and, and congratulations to you. Congratulations to you. That's uh, wonderful. Where is uh, Andrew from Fordham? Andrew. The, uh, Andrew, whenever you're ready. Uh, yeah, sure. Um, thank you for being here and taking my question. Um, do you believe in the mandatory buyback of quote unquote assault weapons? And whether or not you do, how does that idea not go against fundamentally the Second Amendment? Yeah, so, um, great question. I do believe that we need to do buybacks, and I'll tell you why. Um, first of all, let's be clear about what assault weapons are. They have been designed to kill a lot of human beings quickly. They are weapons of war with no place on the streets of a civil society. I've seen assault weapons kill babies and police officers. So one, I'll tell you when elected president, if the United States Congress continues to fail to have the courage to do something about this, I'm prepared to take executive action and put in place a ban on the importation of assault weapons into our country. But we still have to deal with the over two million assault weapons that are currently in the streets of America. And so a buyback program I, is a good idea. Now we need to do it the right way. And part of that has to be, you know, to buy back and give people their value, the financial value of, 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 of what they have and not just take things from people that, that have value without compensating them. We need to do it the right way. But we've got to deal with the fact that these people in Washington, D.C., have failed to have the courage. How many of you guys as college students had to have a drill during high school or middle school or elementary school where you, or even in college, where you learned about how you need to hide in a closet or crouch in a corner in the event that there was a mass shooter roaming the hallways of your school? Look at that. Look at that. And here's the thing. It terrorized you. It is traumatizing. I don't want that any of our children should have to sit in class when you should be paying attention to what's happening in the front of the classroom, letting your mind open up to the wonders of science, math, or art, or whatever, and instead have to be worried about who's going to come banging through the door carrying some kind of weapon. Leaders need to lead on this issue. And so I'm telling you, when elected, if Congress fails to act, I'll give them 100 days to put a bill on my desk for signature. And if they do not do it, I will put in place by executive action, a comprehensive background check requirement, and a ban on the assault weapons and the importation of assault weapons into our country. I'm done. Wow. Look how many raised their hand. Uh, we have time for one more. This is from... Uh, Audrey, uh, Columbia. From, uh, she goes to school in Columbia, Audrey. Uh, whenever you're ready. Hi, so it's on everyone's mind, and I have to ask. Okay. In and out or Shake Shack? In and out, are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, well, come on, Shake Shack! In and out, I am a California girl. Oh, in my. and out. <laughs> In and out or Shake Shack, oh my. <laughs> we'll have a taste test. Thank you so much okay, for taking your time and coming here, please. Good luck to you. Senator Kamala Harris, everybody.